Welcome to Saturday Night Vespers. I'm so glad to get to share this time with you as we wind down from our day. Before we get to our song and scripture reading, let us take three centering breaths together. Oh Lord, the angels watching over me, my Lord, all night, all day. Angels watching over me, and now I lay me down to sleep. Oh Lord, the angels watching over me, my Lord. I pray the Lord my soul to keep. Angels watching over me all night, all day. Oh Lord, the angels watching over me, my Lord, all night, all day. Angels watching over me. The beginning of Proverbs chapter 2. My child, if you accept my words and treasure up my commandments within you, making your ear attentive to wisdom and inclining your heart to understanding, if you indeed cry out for insight and raise your voice for understanding, if you seek it like silver and search for it like hidden treasures, then you will understand the fear of the Lord and find the knowledge of God. For the Lord gives wisdom from his mouth come knowledge and understanding. He stores up sound wisdom for the upright. He is a shield for those who walk blamelessly, guarding the paths of justice and preserving the way of his faithful ones. Then you will understand righteousness and justice and equity and every good path. For wisdom will come into your heart and knowledge will be pleasant to your soul. The beginning of Luke chapter 6. One Sabbath, while Jesus was going through the grain fields, his disciples plucked some heads of grain, rubbed them in their hands, and ate them. But some of the Pharisees said, Why are you doing what is not lawful on the Sabbath? Jesus answered, Have you not read what David did when he and her, his companions were hungry? He entered the house of God and took and ate the bread of the presence which is not lawful for any but priests to eat. And then he gave some to his companions. Then he said to them, The Son of Man is Lord of the Sabbath. Friends, thank you for joining me for Vespers again. I always love this time where we can listen to the word of our Lord together as we end our day and look forward to hopefully a restful night. As we close out our time together, I invite you to pray with me by repeating after me. Dear God, thank you for this day. Watch over me as I sleep and help me to be your child tomorrow. In your name I pray, amen. Good night, friends.